My name is Paul Bruchet. I'm a rancher just outside of Kremlin, Colorado. We run a cow-calf operation, raise hay, um, irrigate out of three different water resources. We also operate a guided fly fishing business um, to help supplement income and work the ranch as a family. Water to our operation means everything. We rolled through or the drought of the early 2000s in the headwaters, learned some lessons there, which is largely why my family and my neighbors are as engaged as we are with water. We are truth testing different forms of measuring water used for irrigation on high altitude perennials. We are studying the recovery of those crops um, after having different forms of treatment to them, full season curtailment, and then a split season where the producer was allowed to irrigate until June 15th and then required to shut off for the remainder of the season. And so I'm excited to continue to learn about the information and data gathered by OpenET. I'm excited to truth test that against many of the other forms and mechanisms that we have working. My hope with OpenET, it completely changes our ability to understand what's going on within our fields. Well, water is the lifeblood of the West, and we have to figure out how to do more or the same with less to get to where we're in solutions. And I think any tools that give us more accurate data, more accurate information, um, and better research are the tools that the West needs desperately right now. Not only related to agriculture, but all water use, is we have to find tools that allow us to understand and to quantify that at great scale. That's where OpenET and more remote sensing technology can help this basin. The more that we have the science and the data, uh, the more that we'll be able to make good decisions.